All right, today on Unpacked, we are gonna spice things up with a brand called Oko. Spicy. So we heard about this brand uh, a while back. We actually have done a little bit of work with them and they are a brand that is trying to reinvent the spice category and um, they are really trying to get down to sustainability. Their message is all about um, using the right amount of spice, the more recyclable packaging, not buying a whole jar for something you're only gonna use once, um, the ability to try new things. So they're, they're all about m kind of micro small doses of spices. Um, so we ordered some up to check it out and uh, see what's happening here. I'm not sure why they let me play with knives. All right, um, so the first things first. On the outside here, they've chosen to stick with a plain white box, but have actually brought their brand in through the use of just custom tape, which is really inexpensive and a really easy way to bring your brand um, to life on a pack when you can't afford custom packaging. All right, let's see here. When we open this up, eat, recycle, repeat is the first thing that we see here. Because most aluminum recycling plants are designed for cans, we recommend crushing your empty pods and sticking them inside aluminum cans. This will ensure our tiny Oko pods don't literally fall through the cracks in the recycling process. Um, recycling questions, hit us up at hello at eatoko.com. All right, I love this. And, you know, this is a conversation that we had had because when you when you really understand the recycling system, size matters um, and tiny things actually fall through the cracks and in, in the process between belts and, and in some of the certain belts and systems. So items that are too small and we usually talk about like three inches or so. Um, tend to actually be detrimental and they wind up as waste, even if they are technically recyclable, which is a term that we use, um, where it's recyclable, the materials are recyclable, but because of its size, it's actually not recycled. So um, I love that they have included this little card and done that little bit of education to help you understand that these pods are too small. And so smash them, shove them into an aluminum can that we know is big enough to, to make it through the system. And um, these are then going to get recycled. So super cool. All right, so what we've got in here, um, I don't know what was ordered, but there's a bunch of stuff in here. So it looks like a few, okay, a few recipe-based orders and then a few individual um products so this is white pepper and they've done a cool job of kind of keeping these generic sleeves here and differentiating with stickers so again love the application and and the way that they've been creative we actually did that here with our business cards um, and if we open these up you can see we've got a uh, these little pod pockets and these little stamped aluminum pods in here. So each one of these things is a half teaspoon and um, it's got a little label on the back side so you know what it is. And then um, this is, so when we were involved, some of the stuff that we had influenced, uh, just in introducing flats so that these things could sit upright. But a super cool little stamped aluminum pod um, with a, an aluminum film on the top um, and then there's just labels that are put on here to identify and differentiate the different products but um, this card here is a, is a little paperboard sleeve that's bonded to create two layers that these pods kind of slip between um, they've done a really cool job and their their logo the way that they've kind of brought in the equity of these circles and these pods um, just have done a really cool job with the brand and have made a lot of progress. So hats off to you guys. Um, so they've done a couple of things here though with packaging. They've got these individual packets of small amounts of spices. And then they also have these meal kits um, and these recipes here. So 
the uh, this one is acorn squash and coconut pepper cream, and the different the different pods that are in here turmeric 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 I don't know I give up um, nutmeg cumin mustard pepper um, they've uh, they've done just a really cool job at bringing that all together into a recipe and giving you all the spices and seasonings that you need. So it's kind of what a lot of the delivery meal delivery kits are doing with all of your ingredients, but they're usually doing it in little like packets of uh, little plastic packets and things like that. So um, yeah, great job. I, I love what they've done with the brand and how it's finally like come to life. Um, the pods and I love most that they've really talked about recyclability and how to manage these tiny little pods. So great job, Oko. We are rooting for you. And uh, if there are any other brands that you want us to check out and do an unboxing of, let us know in the comments below. That's all for now.